taking bets now. What are the odds of this video getting copyright stricken for all of the music clips I'm about to have? Hello everyone, welcome to the Anime Void. I'm Brian, your host, and today I'm giving my top five favorite songs sung in anime plots. And that's a very specific title for a very specific type of anime song. So yeah, no openings, no closures, no background music. It's specifically songs that are sung by the characters within the story of the anime. And as I go further along this list, that will make more sense as I go along. <laughs> I'm also limiting myself to one song per series, so that a single idol series doesn't take up almost all the spots in this list. With that explanation out of the way, let's get into this. Number 5. Number 5 is the Beef Stroganoff song from Symphogear GX. Now this makes it to the list because I am a sucker for Mimi bullshit, and this is an extremely, extremely Mimi song, and I am at least 50% certain that none of this is how you actually make Beef Stroganoff. But hey, it's a cute, catchy, and fun song to just get stuck in your head all the time. It's never left. Number four. <laughs> Number four is Fluffy Fluffy Time, or Fura Fura Time, whatever. K-On! is such a good show, but for a musical-based anime, there's actually not, like, a crazy amount of music in it. Like, yeah, they play a lot, but, like, they don't really sing songs too much, at least within the first season. I think there was, like, only two, two and a half. But Fluffy Fluffy Time was the one they sang on the stage, so it was, like, it was a really cute moment. Where they just kind of grew as a band further than they had at the beginning of the season. It was such a good, feel-good song and moment. And I am proving my ability to talk in videos and explain my thoughts clearly and concisely. Number three. I knew one day we'd be saying goodbye. Just never thought it would be so. Number three is my dear from Zombieland Saga. And I was very tempted to put up the rap battle. Because again, I love memes. I am a sucker for memes. But, my dear is far more important. Because the point of this list is to talk about songs that are sung in anime plots. So the plot surrounding the song should be important and exemplified in the song. Granted, that is not always the case. Given the first two, Kaon had plot significance. Be strong enough, not really. And number one also doesn't really have plot significance, but we'll get to that. But what I'm saying is that plot significance gets bonus points. And here, it's Lily Hoshikawa basically just singing to her father in the audience. This whole song is her singing her goodbye to her father, who is just absolutely guilt-ridden over her death. And as a zombie, she can't reveal that she got resurrected and all that stuff. Complications. But it is such a sweet and sad song. I tear up every single time I listen to it. I am getting choked up right now just thinking about it. Because, yeah, it's such a heartbreaking thing to go through on both ends the loss of a child and being unable to go back to your family and your life but choosing this new life instead and having to say goodbye while also conveying how much you care for the person that you're leaving behind and it doesn't get a higher mark on this list Specifically because part of the opening of the song. Every moment I had with you filled my heart with the deepest of emotions. That was very clumsily translated, and they should have done a better job. <laughs> Doesn't flow right. Number two. What am I so what is my and 
number two is Hero 2 from My Hero Academia. Hey, an anime that isn't centered around music that has a song in the plot. Yay. But no, seriously, not only is Hero 2 an absolute bop, but the everything leading up to the song, all the character building and bonding, and just the desperation of Izuku fighting Gentle Criminal to make sure this song happens so that Eri and his friends can have an enjoyable experience at the cultural festival, and then Eri smiling for like the first time in her life during this song. It's so good! It is the culmination of a great song and great storytelling combined together to make a piece of magic. But what can top this? Number one. There are times when you listen to a song and you hear that first second. And you are transported somewhere else. A truly transcendental experience. And God knows this song can do that. God Knows from The Melancholy of Harui Suzumiya is hands down my favorite song, period. It just hits that right note right in my soul to just give me such an amazing experience to listen to, to visualize in my mind, even outside of looking at the screen. And yeah, Harley's in a bunny suit, that's A-plus material. But at the same time, it's such a good song that I don't need the visuals. It, it, it stands on its own so well and is such just a perfectly crafted song. I don't know music theory for shit, but I can tell you that this song is like a catalyst for something deep within my soul. There are two points in my life, before listening to God's Nose and after listening to God Knows, and that is why it is number one on this list. But that is my list. What are your favorite songs sung in an anime's plot? I know I skipped out on a bunch of series because I limited it down to only five. So I know I skipped completely over Love Live and a whole bunch of other idol anime. But it's my list. I can do what I want. So leave your response down in the comments below. I'm very interested to find out. And if you want to see me and more of my other nonsense, you should like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell icon to miss an upload for me. And follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. And if you want to support this channel even further, please consider supporting me on Patreon. All the links are in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to catch you next time in the void. Later.